wicked witch. Megan's shocking gesture proves she twists husband Harry around her little finger. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's infamous interview with Oprah Winfrey gave us a new insight into their relationship and showed how their roles had changed, body language expert Judy James has claimed. When Prince Harry got down on one knee and asked Meghan Markle to be his royal wife, he knew he had a lot to teach her. Becoming his wife also meant becoming the Duchess of Sussex and marrying into one of the most famous families in the world. In the lead-up to their wedding and in the early months of their marriage, he stood at her side to guide her through official engagements, charity outings and private meetings with the Queen and the rest of the firm. But according to body language expert Judy James, a subtle hand gesture from Meghan Markle proved Harry's role as guide and protector is now over and the tide has changed in their relationship. In their infamous interview with Oprah Winfrey, the couple sat side by side on garden chairs as they detailed their version of life within the royal family. And Judy told the mirror that their hand gestures show that while Meghan appeared confident, Harry was not and needed his wife's support. She explains, I think when Meghan came to the UK, Harry very much saw himself in the role of overly protective husband that knew that all hell was going to break loose in terms of press and public interest, and was desperate to protect her, albeit that she presented herself as a very confident woman. But I think the tide has completely changed looking at the Oprah Winfrey clip. Now she seems to have taken a much more vulnerable Harry back to the US with her and she seems to be more in the role of rescuer and protector with him. This hand gesture that you can see, he's got his hand on the chair and she's placed her hand on top. That's almost a maternal looking gesture, it's though it's being used for reassurance and to let him feed off her confidence. Clearly she's friends with Oprah, she's used to being in front of the cameras she's an actress, but to Harry this is a whole new world that he's being judged by and being asked to perform. According to Judy, Meghan is sitting with a pit-bearing gesture which shows she is confidence. Meghan got the upturned V-gap underneath her armpit which shows a confidence. When we feel like we're being bombarded with difficult questions or we're not comfortable women in particular tend to self-diminish, we bring out arms in. But with Meghan she's got that super self-controlled, confident image going on here. However Judy believes that Harry's body language tells a very different story, saying it suggests he needs that support from his wife. She said, Harry on the other hand is much less self-assured. He is sat diagonally and he kind of looks a lot more awkward. Highlighting that Harry's hand was on his crotch, Judy added, he is doing a male pose, he's got his hand between his legs. It's called the fig leaf pose, it is a very self-protective gesture. She highlights how different his body language is to when he was interviewed by James Corden. Here he looks way more guarded and a lot more uncomfortable and very much in need of that hand clasp that he's getting from Meghan. It comes as a royal expert warns royal family to be careful how they handle Prince Harry. Royal author Brian Hoey believes that the Duke is set to return to a prestigious position within the family, due to the role his father Charles is destined to inherit following the end of the Queen's reign. Mentioning the reported family rift between the Sussexes and the firm, he said, One has to remember, in the not too distant future, although I hope it is going to be a long way in the future, Harry is going to be the son of the king. So they've got to be very careful how they handle him, you see because no matter what happens, they can never take that away from him. To what 